Hello, welcome back to Engineering Sound. In this video tutorial, I will explain how to import KML or shape file in AutoCAD or AutoCAD Civil 3D. And also from the drawing, we will export KML or shape file from AutoCAD Civil 3D by the help of Lisp. So this is very important Lisp. I will provide the link in the description. You can download it from the description. So for example, we have in Google Earth this this area so this area we need to import in AutoCAD co 3D first of all we will save this area as a KML file go and right click and save place as a KML file click here now it's saved so we will jump in AutoCAD co 3D and here we will go to manage from here we can just upload application from here or we can enter ap for upload command and we can upload it by the help of ap command enter and then locate your location and select this kml to dwg and click on load once it's loaded now it's successfully loaded and we will enter the command irt irt this is the command to active the lisp enter here we need to do some basic changing by this help of list you can do a lot of work for example first we will do to change our zone utm 38 north is my zone and here we have these options kml first we will import kml to AutoCAD civil 3d okay this is the option export and import and there is again shape file okay export import so we will explain this all one by one here we need to go to select okay this is our option import and from here we will select the folder where is our kml file save so just click and okay and again okay now this menu will open pop up here you need to select the file option from here just click and locate your location check it my file is in download let me select from here this is our kml file and click here open so it's depend on your file size how much is if it's if it's uh, small it will be uploaded very quickly if it's big it need to take time z space bar and a space bar this is our area you can just compare it with the google earth it will be as per the correct coordinates sting and nothing you can see here okay so now we will go again to irt okay click here irt and from here we will go to export the same file we can export suppose we have drawing and we are going to export any drawing to KML KMZ file we can just select the folder where we want to save and we will we will save it on the desktop or shape file this one okay and click here so now it will be export as a KML file here is giving option to select the drawing which one you want to export as a KML and select here and go to desktop and save here give the name from here suppose you want to give the name any name you can give here dwg or any name and click save you want to open the same file at a time in google earth so you can open it in google earth if you click on the yes button okay yes it will be automatically open in google earth in a moment okay let's see how it's coming okay let's zoom zoom Okay, this is our location here. Okay, yes. This is KML. We export from AutoCAD to KML. So this two option is explained already. Now we will go to the new page and we will we will we will ex we will import KML and the same KML we will export as a shape file okay so shape file you can use in rpgis qgis and a lot of software it's supported by shape file 
okay this is the shape file shp we can just export and uh, click on export and select your location where you want to save your file and now you need to select your object and go where you want to save suppose i want to save is in this folder give the name here dw or any name you can give it okay just click and here you need to enter yes okay so now you when you check it it will be automatically there okay so now it's export so for example if we need to import a shape file so we need to do the same procedure go to irt okay here irt select and from here you need to go to the shape files options and from the shape file option you need to click on import and once you click on the import and then locate your folder okay this is the option import okay click import shape import okay okay select your folder and click on okay and here file click here on the file and from here you need to go to the same folder where you have shape file and this is our shape file just click here and open and open z spacebar spacebar now you will see your shape file is imported successfully so we explained already in this how to export and import as a shape files okay and again from here if you want to do to let me just check okay and here okay yes this all option word gis imaginary and if you want to uh, um, do some other setting from google's you need elevation profile or anything you want to export or import AutoCAD Civil 3D. This all option is available in this list, and by the help of this list, you can do it. And also, there is some countries uh, aerial imaginary or anything you can just import. It's very easily by the using zone or uh, UTM coordinate system. And there is also a lot of option for ArcGIS. You can also. Uh, import it so i hope it's will helpful for you and you can use this list to make your work easy and don't forget to follow share subscribe and comment share with your friends we will see in the next tutorial goodbye take care